What's up guys, Cal here from How to Rip. Today we're going to show you how to do the perfect duck dive every single time. Duck diving is a really important skill to have because it helps us get out the back uh, very efficiently. Otherwise we're going to be spending a lot of time amongst the waves actually getting smashed by the white water. Duck diving enables us to actually go under all that white water. So let's show you how to do it today. Okay, so with the duck dive we're going to have a bit of white water coming towards us today. You're going to have to use your imagination. We're going to bring our arms to the side here, so almost like a push-up position as you can see. And I'm actually grabbing onto the rail. It's almost like the position we use when we're taking off on a wave. So we're going to hold the side of the board there, and we're actually going to press. That's the first step, so we're going to press the board down. As you can see, the board is actually sinking. Now, if you're on a board like a Malibu or a Foamy, this is actually going to be quite hard to do because the more volume you have in the board, the more buoyant it's going to be, the harder it is to actually sink it beneath the water. So obviously, you've got to actually use this in a contextual circumstance. You've got to think about the board you're using. So today, we're going to push down and we're going to sink the board. The next thing we're going to do is we're actually going to bring our foot or our knee to the tail pad of the board. Okay, so that's sort of like the tail of the board, the back end of the board. And that's actually going to push the board, even it up a little bit, and we're going to sink. Now, while I was underwater there, you would have noticed that I actually shifted my grip. So at the start of the duck dive, my grip is actually back here in that push-up position. Once I sink, I'm going to slide my hands up the board and create a bit of an upward trajectory from below the water so that I can leave the water with a little bit of momentum going forward. So let's have a look underwater. Now I've said it before and I'll say it again, duck diving is one of those essential skills that you need to master if you want to advance with your surfing. And remember, it's always easier if you actually want to come and practice in flat water. So using a pool or using a lake is always a good idea to actually uh, get that repetition going with your practice and you'll be out the back in no time at all. 